Hello Aries, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading and it will be for May 2021 for the sign of Aries. So let's get straight into your reading Aries and remember these can just be messages and it won't resonate with everybody. So just take what resonates with you Aries, okay? So what do we have for Aries, please? Angels, spirits, guides, message for our lovely Aries for May 2021, please. What is the message from spirit for Aries? Thank you. Message from spirit for Aries. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to take the ones that have turned up. Oh, the one that's turned up. We have trust the divine plan. You have to trust. Even though you don't see the big picture, the universe does. There is divine orchestration associated with this. Okay, Aries, <clears throat> let's pull you a next card. What do we have for Aries, please? Angels, spirits, guides, what is the message from spirit for Aries for May 2021, please? What do we have for Aries for May 2021? Thank you. What do we have for Aries for May 2021? Thank you. I like this card, Aries. We have memories. Your memories are like diamonds in the treasure chest of your spirit. More and more memories are, are arising within you. Remember the happier moments with your loved ones who are here in the spirit world. For neither time nor distance, distance can stop the energy of love that you have for one another. Feeling of you're being watched over there. <clears throat> So what do we have for Aries, please? Angels, spirits, guides, what is the message for Aries? Your cards are falling out so quickly. <laughs> yeah, we have number 11, dark night of the soul. Life brings new meaning. Sometimes there is tough circumstances that give us the best lessons that give us the best growth, that give us the best inspiration for moving forward. Sometimes it's in time of difficulty that you actually find the deep meanings in how you're being steered by the universe. The 11 is an interesting card because it can be about receiving blessings from loved ones from the other side, signs, symbols, messages. Um, that's the 11-11 energy. It can also be a card of manifestation as well a number of manifestations so <clears throat> it definitely feels in this energy whatever you've been through there was a reason trust the divine plan and it feels for some of you there will be new meaning coming your way <clears throat> let's pull the final oracle card before we go into the tarot cards <clears throat> sorry my voice was just going then so what do we have for Aries, please? Angel, spirits, guides, what is the message from spirit? We have cow, give with unconditional love and grace. Archangels, Raphael and Mary. I also feel you're being shown that Aries. And we have parrot. It's interesting, isn't it? Listen intently to understand. Archangel, Bok P. And it feels to do with this. There is some kind of lesson or direction or... It definitely feels for some of you, you're being steered in a specific direction here. Okay, so what do we have for Aries, please? <clears throat> First card being the message from Spirit. What is the message from Spirit for Aries? May 2021, please. Message from Spirit for Aries, May 2021, thank you. Thank you. Nine of Wands. Wow, the Hermit. <laughs> the Nine of Cups. The World. So there has been a test of faith. 
there has been a test on a difficult journey. This is a battle. This is the wounded warrior who has persevered and amassed nine wands, ten being completion. And you, there's an energy here. You are one step away. One step away, one obstacle, one hurdle, one I to dot, one T to cross. So there's something here, one thing that needs to be done and then you're done. There's completion. You're so close and that's what you're being told. Keep going. There's an energy of perseverance um, because, you know, the wounded warrior, the 11th hour, they want to give up. You know, they're tired. They've come so far. It's been a testing journey and they just want to throw in the towel and walk away. You know, it can be that kind of energy. I don't see the end in sight here because it's the moon in Sagittarius. I don't see the end in sight on this journey. It's close. It's close. Yeah. You're one step away. One step away. And the hermit is there to tell you you are, you are being illuminated. This is the meaning that comes from within. You are being illuminated. And the hermit is not just about illumination, introspection, finding answers from within. The hermit is about what you're finding from within, the, the wisdom, the answer, is how you need to take action, make the sound judgment calls in your external environment. It's a card of healing, the hermit, as well. Um, raising your energy from within. So it feels in this situation, Aries, whatever has tested you, something is nearly over. But you have, it feels for some of you, it's been a difficult journey. It's been a journey of healing. But you are being inspired, illuminated, giving wisdom from within on how you need to take that final step. I mean, that this can sometimes be one practical thing to do, one, you know, physical hurdle to overcome. You know, it can be that kind of energy. There's, there's one physical thing that needs to be done here. And then you're home dry. Because for some of you, where it's a nine, the ten being a completion, you are going to be victorious. You're going to be victorious. You are going to win through. If you persevere, if you keep going, if you keep on aligning with where you feel you need to align to now, finding those answers from within and acting on the illumination that you're being given by source, you will claim a victory, a success. This is worldly success, worldly achievement. And being ready to step through to a new phase of your life. Um, this is goal achievement as well. I mean, this can be a card of goal achievement, a goal being achieved. So it's very, very good energy. Um, the world card, it's having gone through some good and bad experiences, but this person has grown spiritually. They've grown emotionally. They've grown, you know, physically. They've, they've learned some valuable lessons, but they're not beholden to, they're not held hostage to the past anymore. They're ready to step through to a new phase of their life, to a new adventure, and put this past journey behind them. So there's definitely some lessons that you've learned here. Uh, definitely some lessons that you've learned here, Aries, but it definitely feels like there is some worldly success, a uh, completion, a major completion, a cycle completing. And it's as a result of your efforts persistence to see something through and um, like I said it can be a goal achievement as well it can represent victory success and winning um, because the nine of, of cups is getting your heart's desire it's a wish coming true it's getting your wish so it's almost kind of like you're being told you're being illuminated you're being given answers from within. There's some introspection that you've been going through, maybe some healing, working through a situation here. It's been a difficult journey, but you are absolutely aligning to your heart's desire. It feels like there's some goal here. It feels like you're one step away from a goal, getting exactly where you want to be. 
because you know the nine of cups it feels like a personal achievement this can be a card of reasons to be thankful celebratory energy as well as can the world card we have two cards of celebration here you know whistles and bell celebration you know it feels in this situation there is some celebratory energy here because you're getting a wish you're getting a goal you're so close so there's definitely an energy of keep going there's one more thing to do here that could be a practical thing whether it's a test to do or a form to fill in or paperwork to send off or you know a trial to overcome i mean call it what you will aries but it feels in this situation it's closer than you think and everything will become clear with that life brings new meaning what you've learned the good and bad on the journey has empowered you to step into the next phase of your life and i love this energy because it's just happiness joy being uplifted feeling happy a sense of accomplishment each one of those cups lined up on a trophy shelf. Look at my achievement. Look at what I've delivered. So it feels very, very beautiful indeed. It's going to be worth it. I'm hearing it's going to be worth it. The effort is going to be worth it. Wow. So final message for Aries. Yeah, we have your intuition is strong. We are reaching out to help. I'm going to pull you one more, Aries. Final message for Aries. Thank you. Final message for Aries. Celebration is near. And that's what I'm getting here. Uh, it feels like there's going to be some goal achievement celebration. Okay, two have come out. <laughs> it's interesting, isn't it? As soon as I said that, have you laughed today? Find your joy, lift your soul, number 17. And we have, we understand that sometimes you may feel alone, but we are always here, number 12. Lovely energy, Aries. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful, I hope it's a wonderful month for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.